Hey, hey guys, so this is going to be my summer makeup tutorial for you guys, kind of like a little routine thing. I'm going to be showing you the products I use. The first thing I'm going to do is take off my makeup and I use a philosophy release me. And then I just scrub my lips so that when I apply lipstick, it is a lot nicer and a lot smoother. I don't like the taste of it, of dry skin, so I just wipe it right off. Next, you're going to pick between a moisturizer and a sunscreen. Today is 4th of July, so I'm using sunscreen. And I'm just going to apply that all over my face because I need it. And it's going to be really, really, really hot out. Next step you're going to want to do is you're going to want to choose a primer that works for you. My favorite primer is the L'Oreal Magic Perfecting Base. Because it's not oily and it just blends in super nice. Those are my two foundations, um, Neutrogena and my Stila One Step Bronzer. I just blend it together to make a very nice um, summery shade and just apply it to my face. I would normally be using a brush. Again, I'd stipple this on, but just for today because I don't really have any good brushes um, at my dad's, I'm just going to be using my fingers, which works nicely if you wash them. And it just makes a really nice even tone because I'm combining really light and like a, a bronzing kind of color. So, and it gives you pretty much full coverage without feeling very, really, really heavy. My erase paste from Benefit, which isn't even like in my tone, but it is in the tone medium and it does work if you blend it out and you do use it right. I just kind of stipple it on with my hand and it blended in and it works really, really nice. $10 value. Next I'm going to be using the Maybelline e eraser and I have the shade brightener and I just leave it on for a few seconds so that it can, you know, soak up underneath my eyes and brighten them. Next is the e.l.f. Zip Dabbing Concealer. I love this e.l.f. product. Uh, I don't usually recommend e.l.f. because it, well, it's cheap but it's got a lot of parabens. But I really, really like this product and it gets rid of the zits easily. And now I'm just blending it all in and my eraser paste in and everything in so that you know, it all combines into my skin. I was singing, so that's why my mouth is making weird movements. And next, but certainly not least, is the Wicked Highlighter from Urban Decay. It's very, very shimmery, and you can definitely, definitely feel the shimmers. I just apply that all over my um, highlighter area, the top of the cheekbone. I don't know. I like the way it works. This is the best powder I've ever used in my entire life. It's Rimmel and it is the Stay Matte in 001 Transparent. And I'm just using a brush to puff that together. And it makes a really, really nice matte finish. It's such, such a smooth texture. And it does not shine or anything. And I feel like it just brings everything together. Urban Decay Primer Potion. I'm just going to apply that all over my lid because that is like my favorite primer potion I've ever used. I do not like to bronze too much just because I am very very pale but the Ulta bronzer is really really nice and just gives you that nice like radiant glow. Again I apologize for the squinting. I think in the summer it's really nice to use a cream blush as a base so it sticks on better and I just stipple that on with a stippling brush. I absolutely love to set it with the powder because then I actually it actually sticks and acts like a vase. And this is the NYX um, in Summer Peach. And this is the eye brightener which just gives the underneath my eyes an extra oomph. I actually really, really like this. I feel like I have a lot of under eye stuff but I have really bad under eye circles. This is the Stardust Bobbi Dazzle Eyeshadow. I like to just apply this to my brow bone because it gives it like a sparkle and this stuff will last you like all day long. My favorite thing in the entire world is the color tattoos. Now I'm going to make a separate video on this, but the one that I use the most in the summer is the golden one. It's called Bold Gold, and I really like this because I feel like it actually, um, it actually holds. Like, it holds at water parks, it holds at everything. So if you want an eyeshadow that sticks, I would go with a Maybelline color tattoo. I have this in like four different colors. So then I also take that same side of the brush that I'm using right there and I use it to apply it to the inner corner of my eye and that is my brush for my Naked 2 palette. 
and I am seriously going to have to invest in another Urban Decay brush like this because this is an amazing brush. Next, I'm using my Naked Palette for my crease, um, and I'm using these two colors in Suspect and Pistol, and I'm just applying it to my crease. Next, I'm going to be using a mascara primer, and this is my e.l.f. mascara primer. I don't really need a lot of mascara, so I don't really want to invest in a high-end mascara primer, but you can definitely substitute it for, like, anything. Next, I'm curling my lashes. This is just a simple um, e.l.f. eyelash curler. And again, like, I don't really have to curl my lashes, but it is something that I have, you know, been accustomed to do. Next, I'm going to use a regular drugstore mascara, and this is just Sexy Curves by Rimmel. I really like to start out with, like, a normal drugstore mascara, and then when I really want to go the extra mile, I add more of a high-end one. I like to keep one high-end one on me at all times. This is Herb Decay Super Curl Lash or whatever, and I like to use this one. Next, I'm going to use, I'm not using a lot of it, I usually do the 24-7 um, eyeliner, which is the best eyeliner I've ever used. Now on the lips. I start out the lip stain so that it just gives it a base and it gives the other stain something to grip onto. It's very light. This is my favorite, favorite stain. Revlon Just, just Kitten, Just Bitten, <laughs> Kissable Lip Balm. I really, really love this stuff. I'm probably going to have to do a review on that stuff too. Next, after that dries, I just add like a gloss and I love using the Revlon Lip Butter and Strawberry Shortcake. That is my absolute favorite kind of lip butter. And there you go guys, that is my finished summer look. I always like to add a bit of shimmer mist to my body just because I feel like adding a little bit of shimmer mist to my legs gives me that um, beach glow. Alright guys, so we'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching and I end up, I end the day with my makeup spray and I use this out 3-4 times a day. And it is my de-slicking spray from Urban Decay, the best stuff I've ever used. So, yeah, you should go check that out. Alright, thank you guys. Again, I'm sorry for the squinting. Um, it was hard to see because I couldn't. I don't have a viewfinder, so it was like difficult to see. Love you guys. Mwah!